Hello Pyros and welcome back to my Let's Play on Civilization V, Brave New World. Um, last time we left off, our economy has gone to shit, so now we're losing um, money, which is not good. You can't let that happen. Um, I need to figure out what the hell. It's been like, I played last night, so I won't be able to respond to you guys' comments or suggestions. Uh, I apologize for that. I just want to play this game so damn bad <laughs> that I had a get more recording in um we're doing great on food that i think we're, we're doing great there um let's see we got the aztecs down here and then we fin just finished exploring and that's where i left off someone else made it to classical era so it's just me and this guy right here that hasn't been classical era it hasn't made it to the classical era yet I also have these guys run around and patrol. I think we dealt with the barbarian threat. They might come from the right here. On this continent. I think we should be good. We should be good to take over this continent too. Someone working the horses. Yeah, someone is. <clears throat> so we got solid production here. Really, really good. Oh yeah, we're working on the wonder right now. That's right, that's right. It's a big project that's going to help us down the road a lot. Um, let's see how many units we got. We got archers and warriors. I thought we had another group of warriors. Or did they die? No, I... I s yeah, they're healing up here. That's where they are. Okay. Oh, there's a barbarian camp up here. That's right. We're going to go deal with that now. Actually, we haven't even explored this area. So I'm going to get these guys up. See, I'm basically my scouts at the moment. And we're gonna increase in population. Your people are no longer happy. Right, so we're not even happy anymore. So we need to chill out on the expanding and deal with this. Because if we're unhappy like this, um, we don't grow. Golden production output is reduced by 2% for each point of unhappiness. So it's basically not affecting us other than we can't grow. Um... So we need to uh, we need to deal with that, definitely. So we got silk is getting plus for happiness. I think after we get spices, we'll get plus more happiness. We'll deal with that, and this will get our economy going if we get this town running. Let's see what the workers working. Okay, they're working both gold tiles, so we're making plus three gold. Look at that, guys. Problem solved, just like that. We would like to be making more money, but we're not going the negative, which is important. Stopped um, growing though. There we go. Now we're now we're growing in population again because look. Oh, we're not making as much gold though. There's three gold tiles on there. How's that? Oh, they decided to shift. That's why. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. Okay, can I do this without having stopped growing? Yeah, we're gonna do that. Get some gold, and we just got four happiness for building that plantation right there. All right, guys. Keep trucking it up. It's gonna end right here, but it's nice to get a nice view of everywhere. What is that? Okay, this is another. Um, oh, it's just their crappy little ships that don't do anything. So we're fine there. All right, warriors. We're going in. They're still wounded. Oh yeah, we gotta get our fucking workers back. I remember. We're gonna seek revenge. We'll send these guys up if they need help. For some reason, they spawn more guys. And our fates should be going up pretty soon here. I'm not fate, sorry. Um, our um, culture. Because we have good culture at the moment. Ooh. Wait. The city of my name wants gems. Connecting that resource to your trade network will cost the city to love King Day. Yeah, sorry guys. I don't know what the hell gems are. And there's sheep over here. We'll walk up here and just see the ocean. Alright. Um, I forgot what I was going to do. Or something important too. Okay, well, we're going to attack these guys. Oh wow, that's an even battle right there. It should be leveling up soon. Research, that's actually what I was going to do. 
Um. Okay, bronze working. It's pretty good. So when we're attacking a city, you get plus 15 strength. Percent. Um, more experience. And we can get spearmen. I think we're gonna go for that. And then we can chop, um, jungle. We don't have jungle here, I don't think. That's jungle right there, right? Yeah, that's jungle. There's some jungle. So that's just good for us. Of course it's good for us. What am I talking about? Alright, our unit got promoted. Range attacks. Hmm. Hmm. I think I'm just gonna upgrade them in um, smooth terrain. That's right, I'm planning to attack these guys soon. They're the weakest besides us. Yeah, look at them 99. They're still weak, 138 compared to us. Alright, guys, come on. I want a better fight than last time. Looks like they got. Oh, shit. Never mind. How much was that? 23. Okay, yeah, that was a better fight. And they're barely alive. So we'll take them out next turn. What do you guys see? Another fucking barbarian boat. I don't know what those boats do. Oh, oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's, he's legitimately declaring war like that all of a sudden. Okay. Does he have an army near us? Oh, shit. They just came up out of nowhere. Oh my fucking god, I didn't see his arm becoming. What the hell? Okay, you guys take this. You've got no time for this shit, but. <laughs> we're so close, so. Might as well. God damn, we're in trouble, guys. We got a new policy. Next turn. Oh, this is. This is bad. We got archers here, at least. <laughs> Wait, uh. Yep, yeah, whatever. We'll just bombard that pointless boat. Alright. Our wars will be there soon. Shit. Oh, uh, we don't have any gold to buy any units. Okay, so. Let's get these guys, because there are generals behind there. And generals, all it is doing is buffing them. It's Robert E. Lee. <laughs> That's funny. If you guys don't know, Robert E. Lee is in the uh, Civil War. He was a general in the Civil War. I just learned that this year. <laughs> it's the only reason I probably know. I remember. Okay, so. This fucking asshole just came out of nowhere and declared war. Alright! I'm actually kind of worried. Got a lot of guys. He's fucking with their land. Okay. Warriors, you gotta, you gotta haul your asses over here. New policy. This is war. So, I'm gonna go for something in here, I think. Yeah, we can produce melee units faster. That is something I'm gonna be getting. Ooh, and we got a general from that, too. I didn't read that stupid meme, but it worked. This is perfect timing, actually. Alright. Gotta get these guys off of us right now. Come on, then, guys. Finish them off. Alright, they should... If they attack us again, they'll die. And our city just healed back what damage they did. And we got our workers back, so good news there. Let's get our workers back over here. Alright. Got their archers on a city now too. Like, this is scary looking, but really it's not. Because they um this lake is awesome. It's basically making them so that they can't get to us easily. They approach the wrong way. I didn't see their armor coming though, that's what surprises me. Alright, let's finish these guys off. But, yeah, this seems like we'd be screwed and we're gonna lose the city. But look at it, it's just regenerating just as much as they're doing. It's because they don't have siege units yet. They don't have the army that be sieging us yet. 
still a little early to try, you know, waging war on someone. Would have to be really weak for them to win. But we're not weak. Uh, let's move him behind here. He should be buffing all the guys. Combat, strength. I'm actually putting them with these guys. City's about to increase in population. Perfect, perfect. One is going to be done pretty soon, too. Alright. You know what, guys? I'm, I'm going to. I think I'm gonna be declaring war with everyone around the world, so it will be like war against everyone. Just to make this interesting. I think it'll be more fun that way. These guys will we'll probably clear the, these guys out, no problem, pretty soon. I'm not worried. There's actually more down here, that's right. We'll just clean you guys up. This army seems like it's never ending though. Yeah, those guys are done dead moving these guys to take out their archers oh look at this row of archers they're just gonna sweep right through them this could have been bad actually that many archers and thankfully all right so if you guys are in the city like my archers are they won't be hit they can't get attacked they have to destroy the city first so that's nice i'm trying to get my workers back one piece and we need these guys to get in here i know they're hurt but we need them Safety precautions. It seems like they're retreating. Like, they're scattering away. They're, actually, they're gonna take some damage while retreating, though. So, they just lost half their army. That was a fail attack. Finish them off. Snipe them at the ankles. Take them down. You can't escape us now. I might actually be able to take out these archers in one turn. Alright, guys. Can you do it? Oh, not you. These guys. No, we can't, actually. Wow. So all that sandwich? I thought they would. Okay. Um, you can just do nothing this turn. Warriors, keep running back. You guys, actually, you guys can, um... Hang on. Do your own stuff. They'll get into this town and start working. This town's already... Pretty well built up. Still needs work though. Next border expansion soon. And same here probably. Yeah, one turn actually. Expanding out to more fields. Oh no. They're like rearranging. Hector with a spear eleven cubits long in his hand. Bronze working's done just in time. Right when we are at war. Actually gonna make them a medic. Um yeah, let's get them a medic. They'll heal the units around them. I mean, we don't have the units right now, but I mean, just... These guys are going to become... Our main warriors down in the future. I know you guys are probably like, what the fuck, why would you want um, Clubman down later in the game? Well, we can upgrade them as soon as we get the technology. We can upgrade these guys to swordmen. And screw people up. Once we get the technology, too. And we can open technology tree. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so this is just the complicated version of it. So it splits off. We got all the golden ones that are the ones we have. And actually, sailing's the last um, ancient era technology we need. And then we're in classical. Um, when it says they're in the classical era, it just means they have one technology in the classical. They could have just ditched all the technology, he like all the technology here, and just went down for like horseback riding or something. And then you're classically, I mean, you're ba basically classical era, but it's harder to do it that way. But, you know, so I don't think we're really behind in technology. So we're going to get sailing. Um, I mean, yeah, I, I guess it could be useful um, for us in a second here. No, I want my warriors. Finish them off. All right, let me go. This arch is done, too. Alright, and then our warriors are almost... What is that? Is that like... It's almost built. Farm's not even done. Population increase soon. Okay. We're doing great, guys. They, they proven they have a way stronger army than us. But we've proven we're smarter and... <laughs> 
Ooh, iron. There's iron here. So, okay, so since we got um, bronze working, now iron shows up on the map. We got six iron up here. Holy crap, that is the jackpot up there. We're gonna need a city up there after we deal with these guys. I think we should expand down here and deal with them first. And then we got a little bit of iron, two iron right there. Uh, we don't need iron right away. Like, we have no, no units that require iron at the moment. But we will in the future. And actually, there's iron right here. Six iron right there. Oh, man. We're going to snap all this iron. And I don't think they have any iron down here. <laughs> so they're starved. It could go down. If it goes down this way, and or it around and they can get there. They might have, like, one iron resource. But we technically can get three iron resources. At the moment, we have none available to us, which isn't great. But the potential's there, guys. That's what matters. Um... Can move these guys here and snipe them. No, I can't. What am I thinking? Let's move back. Are these guys running. Uh, can we make roads? Yeah, I think we can make roads. Our workers should get to work on roads. Um, sometime. Sometime. They got more places to work on right now. To be honest, I think that's it. Our wonder is done in a few turns. Yeah, they, they just lost every single one of their units. I think. So. Goodbye to them. <laughs> and I'll just be able to do a counter attack on them. Well, no, I'm not strong enough. Their arms stronger than mine. Defensively, you have a huge advantage. Um, fortify. You guys just hold out there, and then we'll these guys come in. Deal with them. Actually, did a decent amount of damage to my guys. Okay. Population increased here, sweet. Border will grow up to the north a little bit here. Um, our work, our population is good enough to we're almost covering every tile, which is pretty sweet. Um, they're covering at least every useful tile, I should say. And they want dyes. We got dyes down here. All right. Um, oh, it's general. Do nothing. Alright, and then these guys. Let's get in position. Yeah, we only have three units, guys. That's not enough to do anything. I mean, that would be enough to maybe take a. No, it wouldn't. Actually, that's not even enough to take their. Any. Their capital without any troops. It says you will receive a. Extreme warmonger penalty if you capture this cap capital. So I'm guessing everyone's gonna think I'm like barbarians and barbaric, which I'm fine with. I'm okay with that. We're gonna be going to we're gonna be taking over this world anyways. I don't care what to think. Oh, they, uh, they're just running. All right, just hold up, guys. 